Michigan State Police say one teenager is in critical condition while another is recovering after an overnight shooting in Montcalm County. Authorities say that they've arrested two men suspected of shooting the teenagers, but they're still working to track down more people involved. News 8's Donovan Long picks up the investigation near Stanton. Troopers saying gunfire erupted outside of a home at this intersection up ahead. As authorities continue investigating the shooting, neighbors are left wondering what happened. It's really unreal, honestly. Neighbors still coming to grips with the shooting Michigan State Police say happened near Brent Wells' home. Still trying to process everything. Troopers telling News 8, two suspected shooters opened fire outside this home just off M66 between Stanton and Sheridan around 2 o'clock this morning. Investigators confirming two women in their late teens were shot. They came in a vehicle to this address for some sort of transaction, which we're looking into what that transaction was, and it ended up in gunfire. Authorities say that vehicle is still missing. They tell News 8 they're looking for a 2000 gray GMC pickup with a silver driver's side door. Officials say the front and side windows are likely riddled with bullets. They are also looking for as many as four other people that may be involved. It's all a part of an investigation residents say they never expected to watch unravel in their neighborhood. I mean, I've been here for 20 years and we've never had anything like this. As investigators continue collecting evidence and following leads, Neighbors reflect on what could have happened by living in the right place at the wrong time. Well, I was looking out the window there and I was watching them kind of like count the holes on the fence, on the wooden fence, and I'm like, damn, like, you know, what if? And I had my son here last night. Reporting near Stanton in Montcombe County, Donovan Long, News 8.